Yeah, this morning on Home Improvement, we're going to look at tinting your windows. Everyone thinks, Simon, don't they? Everyone thinks about tinting the windows on their car. Uh, one, one to prevent heat, but also people like a bit of privacy. But not everyone automatically thinks about tinting the windows on their home. Yeah, well, that's it. I mean, you do. You go buy your car and you think, oh, you want it to look nice. But I've lived in my house for eight years now, and I've hated the summertime when the sun comes. Look, I've got great views out there, but the sun belts into that land room and it's so hot. So you could put curtains up, obviously, but, but well, then that ruins your view. You've well, got a lovely view of the water. Absolutely. So, and it, you, it does. It yeah. ruins your view. But even with curtains up, you're still getting heat coming through into the room. This actually reduces it before it's getting into your room. So, yeah, fantastic. So we've got Mal on the line. Mal. Now, who's, where's Mal from? Mal's from Forest Glass Tinting. Okay. And he's the expert. Mal, good Good morning. Good morning, boys. How are you, mate? It, it, it's, it's true, isn't it, Mal? You think about tinting the windows of your car, but you don't automatically think about your home. Well, that's right. A lot of people just automatically get their cars tinted. Yeah, and, they and come from the dealership that way. Yeah, and look, there's a, there's a lot of different kinds of tint. This is the thing that I found out as well. I mean, you've got different colours, different shades, uh, different looks even, and you can change, like, what you, you know, when you did my house, um, the, we even changed it in the kitchen because the kitchen, we didn't want to darken the room up as much for light. So it was something That's to think point. about That's as well. Point, yeah. Correct. Yeah, so does it help with safety as well? I mean, you know, with windows being, you know, if you run into a glass window, um, will the tint actually stop it from cracking and breaking as well? No, it won't stop the glass from cracking, but the, any film applied to glass is going to increase the safety of the glass. Right. There are films that are designed to meet Australian standards and they're much thicker than your normal solar films, even though they are available in a solar film. Okay. So there's sort of kind of two different things. Most people with their safety film full are... Uh, are specifically have that in mind to prevent the glass from falling apart should it get broken. Yep. And other people, you know, are just there to try and stop the heat coming through the glass. Now, are there different degrees of tint for a house? Many different degrees. Yeah. You can start what what would you way. recommend? I, you know, like it's it, three things I'd say to people. Uh, you know, how do you want the appearance to look from outside? How do you want it to feel when you walk into the room? And that will determine darkness. Outside will return them. Do you want it dark? Do you want it reflective? And, you know, how important is it to stop the heat? Yeah, we, I mean, so, we used, what, what did we use on mine? We used the Solar Guard Slate 20 in the, uh, in, the, in the lounge room and we lightened it slightly to the Slate 30 in the kitchen. Okay, and what does the difference mean between the 30 and the 20? Is that a heat difference? Is it reflective? What? It refers to visible light transmission. So the, the, the lower the number the darker the material. Okay, <laughs> all right. So in, in your kitchen, yep. your kitchen had a limited, you know, amount of glass. We're in your lounge room and your, and your dining room. Half the wall was glass. Oh, look, it's, it's made such a dramatic difference have in you, my house. Have you had been able to turn your air conditioner off or down? Oh, you know, it's not running nearly as much yeah. is, the, is the thing. The room's not got a, getting as hot in the morning. So you walk out and it's not instantly hot as soon as you, you know, you're working in a hot room already. And you've still got that view. Yeah. yeah. Mal, is window tinting, because this is a home improvement program, I wouldn't dream of doing it myself because I can't even put my car rego sticker on. But, but Mal, would you, would you recommend people, could, could you do it yourself? It is possible with some instruction to do it yourself. You know, there are some pretty practical people around. What I advise to most people is if it's where your mother-in-law sleeps, do it yourself. But if it's somewhere where you would look at it all the time or visitors would see it, have it done professionally. Yep. Okay. You know, how, so, mu how much is it a square metre, Mal? Um, if, most solar films are going to run somewhere between 60 and $80 a square metre, supplied and fitted, plus GST. So that's about your ballpark. And what sort of guarantee or warranty comes with that? Most of them are averaged on about 10 years. Okay. And most companies, 10 years? Most of them would be about 10 years. Now, there are different grades of, of, of tint as well, like anything, like paint. We can buy cheap paint Correct. and we can buy really good paint. Does it make a big difference? It does. It does. Yeah. Okay. You've, got, you've got some mainstream, you know, like the big four or five manufacturers whose products work really well. Yep. And we've got some smaller players where... The products aren't so good. You might buy something from a hardware store and think it's doing the same job, but it simply doesn't keep the heat out the same way. Yeah, okay. You know, All specialist right. companies make products that do, you know, that, that really work. Can so I, how do people tell? I mean, how do they know if they're getting a good tint, a good quality tint? Is there, is there codes well, on it? Um, the Window Film Association is a good starting point. Okay. You know, most quality, most you know, reputable companies are a member of the Window Film Association. 
So the, it's the you know IWFAA. You can always look on that site. Okay, I didn't um, know there was one. No, I didn't either. No, the International Window Film Association of Australia and New Zealand, yeah, you can look on that and they will refer you to any of their members. All right, well, that's, that's fantastic. Can I ask a really stupid question, Mal? Does the film go on the inside of the glass or on the outside? Mostly internal, wherever possible fitted internal. There are external films available, very limited um, pr- um, products available for external, but where possible, always fit the film internal. I was just wondering about scratching it and yeah. damaging it. And look, I know you do have one also that is clear and still stops heat too, isn't it? Absolutely. So you yeah. don't actually have to change the look of your glass no, to you stop don't. that heat transfer. Mm-hmm. So, you know, but it is more expensive, isn't it? Oh, uh, yeah, that's, you know, something like from Solar the LX70, it is, it, it runs at about $180 a square metre. But are you going to save like money? Fitted. Are you going to save money? You know, it, it, you know, I've done some big jobs with that same film, and where it's important that the view does not change change it a bit you know there are films that are the cheaper films that would almost do the same thing the reflectivity would slightly increase yep but um you know there are films for everybody yeah all right this mal fascinating stuff thank you for that you're welcome where's mal from mal's from forest glass tinting and he's on my website in my preferred tradesman list and uh can we just get your number mal zero four one eight two four six three nine four we'll get you directly in touch with me or go to the, go to the website of the uh, organisation, which is what again? My website. No, no, the w- website for the uh, governing body for Windows. Oh yeah, that's the IWFAA, International Window Film Association. Okay. That's Australian. Okay, okay, and they'll point you in the right direction. Good on you, Mal. Thank you for that. You're welcome. Thanks, mate. Oh, it's there made a difference go. to you. I'd be very keen to see the difference in your power bill next. Uh, Oh yeah. Okay. oh yeah, I mean it's just it's more comfortable in there, and you know what? I can watch telly better too because I've got all that glare on the telly. Okay, it's made, it's made a huge yeah. difference. All the furniture is not going to get damaged as much. Look, it, it is. I tell you, one of the best things I've done to the home. Very, very good. Good on you, Simon. Thanks for that. There, home improvement.